Gandalf, this is the only way to travel. Of all the videos that I have created in the past two years, Walk into Mordor has certainly been one of the most challenging. Over half the shots in this video are a composite of three or more elements, each shot separately against a blue or green screen, and then layered together in Adobe After Effects. This allowed me to accomplish a number of visual tricks throughout the video. Thanks a lot, Gandalf! <laughs> One of my favorite examples is the shot with the giant catapults that fire the cave trolls through the air. The model I used for the catapults is actually only a couple inches long, definitely not big enough to fire a cave troll. So, when I composited the orcs, the trolls, and the catapults together, I shrunk all of the other elements down, making the catapults look massive. What the? the shot where the flying cave trolls take down the eagle was a lot of fun and a lot of work. First, I shot the eagle and each troll against a solid backdrop. Then, using keyframes in Adobe After Effects, I adjusted the size and position of each cave troll to make it look like he was flying past the camera. Then, I composited the eagle into the shot, lining up the elements just right to make it look like the troll and the eagle were interacting with each other. Of course, the background is one of the most crucial elements in a shot like this. In order to achieve the illusion that the camera was high in the air and looking around, I created a giant background plate in After Effects. The plate measured over 7,000 pixels wide and over 6,000 pixels tall. Having a plate this massive allowed me to punch in with the camera and then move up and down, back and forth to make it look like the camera was moving around within a 3D environment. As a few final touches, I added flaming arrows flying through the air and an orange glow from the distant Eye of Sauron. The Baradura model was actually created by a fellow LEGO fan named Kevin Walter. I found images of his impressive model on Flickr, and then I emailed him and asked if I could use the images from his Flickr account in my video. So I downloaded the images off of the internet, cut out the Baradur model using Adobe After Effects, and composited it into my shots. Compositing is a lot of work to master, but once you've done so, it opens up limitless possibilities. Thanks very much for watching. As usual, I will be responding to the first 50 questions that are asked. I'm currently working on a few more awesome videos that will be coming out later this year. So please subscribe and please check back in again soon. Thanks guys.